hands are so cold. So if I if I my performance isn't that good, it's I blame the hands. Well, I'll leave the, the microphone on for a couple of minutes, so you can decide if you wanna if you wanna have these annoying sounds. So they're annoying to me. So I'd imagine they'd be annoying as blue as well. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm one of those that like to hear keyboard noises, but let's turn down this music a little bit. Turn up, oops, turn up the game sound. <coughs> Leave it on. Oh, the trees, they're beautiful. He went on as well. As it's expected. I think he's a big fan of Hans. Okay, it seems most people want it on. I guess I'll leave it on then. Good thing is, there's no lag at all. It's a good thing playing Scandinavians. Let's lure a couple of deer as well, because I think there's a lack of sheep. Lack of sheep, pardon my English. Let's go, Scar now. It is a tournament, well, sort of. Two boars. I guess I should scout better. Maybe he stole it. So his score is lower than mine, so either he's doing here or he's he's still stealing a boar. I can't see a four. Should have checked that as well. So scouts, scouts might not be ideal, but um, I'm just gonna scout him, then I'm gonna go back again and draw some more deer. Seem like he has more than one boar either. So, yeah, he's throwing deer. Okay, I guess there's only one boar. I'm not exactly sure how this will play out. I guess normal feudal war, and then you start trying to transition to the middle, somewhat. is a sort of wall. Well, it might maybe a wall off this side, so it's easy to wall off.
That was bad. So we're safe from scouts there. We can just place like two spears here and then we should be safe. I don't know what else he's going scouts. Fingers are still so cold. <laughs> Not worth it, he's taking damage. I'm not going to the middle, so yeah, it has to be scouts. Let's get the hurt villager away. Yeah, there are the scouts. So we wall off that part and we'll start playing aggressive. So we have two spears out. So it's probably not cost efficient to fight them. The game feels a little bit laggy. Like the game itself, not the ping. Place the ranges here, in front of the gold. Bloodlines, because why not? We'll add more scouts if necessary. Oh, that's bad. Because we're just adding ranges now as well. Safe now, so we'll go here and we'll wall up this part as well. Actually, no, we won't. No, we can't be part of that. I want to do wheelbarrow next, so I'll even stop the leisure production just to get it done. He had the second archery range up faster than me. First one as well, I guess, since when he was making his second, I was making my first. So. I'm not sure how many archers he has. He did not do bloodlines, so he's potentially gonna be up faster than me. He's made three spears, he keeps adding farms. I am as well, but one teaser style might be good on this map because adding more TCs might give you a lack of army. Army is gonna be crucial towards the later stages. Let's try to put on some aggression. Did 
doesn't have tongue wash. You'll see my archers coming over there. But I guess I should have kept at least one archer in the range so I couldn't see that they had left. Yeah, okay, so my scouts are gonna lure his archers a little bit away, and then I'll come in and snipe my archer too. Okay, we saw it. He has bloodlands now as well. So you're going full fuel, because there's a lot of scouts. We grab as many archers as we can. I'm curious to why he's added so many scouts. I might have to do a tower on the gold. We should probably wall off a little bit, just to be safe. Yeah, he's going heavy fuel. We just get a tower up and go, go up faster than him. Then my tech advantage should be enough. only one should not place the tower because my second wall is very exposed. So he's kind of going for it because he knows I'll have a crossbow soon. I don't agree with his decision to just YOLO in there. He's kind of going all in now. We just wall up that, then we... It's gonna struggle to do a lot of damage. So I can just keep my coin forever. Still going pretty much all in. We only lose a couple of villagers, but it's fine as long as I kill this all of his army. He keeps sending units in. Sucking too many units. Now he's not gonna be able to fight back my army. They take a lot of villager losses, but it's fine, really. I can do that here as well. I'm gonna get some on the stone so we can get TCs up in the middle. Yeah, and you know, if he if he was stonewalled, if he was. Um, Yeah, if I couldn't deal any damage to him, then potentially it could still be in a good spot, but I think he's lacking too much army. Okay, all his armies are there, so we'll just go and we'll sit under his tower. You can't take all. You can look at the scores as well, we're getting pretty, pretty good at GG. <coughs> Are you underestimated, Supi? No, I don't underestimate him. I just know that... I just have a good feeling on how the game is going to develop. I would have got a TC up in the middle as well, so...